G'day, Pete from Bunyip Saffron here. Uh, well, the picking season's finished, and uh, I'll show you how many flowers we got shortly. But uh, what I did want to show you is how the saffron is growing. So here are our nice looking beds, and other than a few weeds, um, they're growing really well actually, I'm really happy with them. As you can see, they've thickened up nicely, and we'll be pulling all these up in December and replanting them. Uh, but what I am most happy with with these beds is the fact that we've had a bit of rain, and down in here, it's really um, down in here. It's really uh, it's not that wet at all. It's just nice. Um, so I think our brew for the dirt mixture was was really good. Okay. So, how many flowers did we get, and what weight did we end up getting out of the stingers? Oh, by the way, the um, the wind came up the other weekend, <laughs> blew, blew our uh, greenhouse down. So, that's not very good, is it? Anyway, so I've had to move the uh, all the uh, tubs of our first year uh, corms, and I'll show you where I'll put them. By the way, uh, did you know that corms only grow for one year and then they die and then uh, more corms grow in its place and that's how it reproduces all right so what we did is if you have a look down here uh, I'll put all the tubs with our first year corms which are all growing quite well uh, down the side of the house here on, the, on this side of the house and the reason I did that was a because our greenhouse blew down and B, uh, because these were getting too wet, uh, they were getting really wet and they're just starting to dry out now. So they really don't need any more water. Uh, they do need the sunshine, however. So this is facing uh, north, the way you're looking now is north. And as you can see, uh, they're going to get plenty of sunlight that they need over the winter. And also they're exposed to the cold. So yeah, well I won't touch them again now till December. And I'll definitely dig these up and replant. Right. So we ended up with a grand total of da 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 da, six hundred and seventy-seven flowers, and that produced about five grams of quality dried stigma. Stigmas, uh, and to if you think of it, grams, five grams at fifty dollars a gram. That's two hundred and fifty dollars worth of product in the first season. Uh, sale price not no profit there's no, there's no profit this year i can tell you um so we value added and we made this uh, bunyip saffron uh, syrup and there's all our information on the back i'll hang on i'll show you again so you can pause and contact me if you need to right so yeah that's the wrap so this coming year we've got a few changes happening and I will show you them as I go. But certainly there's a lot to do between now and the end of the year when we transplant the corms. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers. Bye now.